Hey guys, welcome to this video. The objective of this video is going to be to look at a sample soil. We're going to be looking at particle size definitions and we're also going to be looking at how we actually measure a soil. So, first things are first, what is a soil, right? A soil, if we took a sample from the ground, is going to have all different particles, right? All different sizes and all probably all different chemical compositions, okay? In soil mechanics, we're not so concerned about the chemistry of the soil. What we are concerned about is this dif different distribution <coughs> of particle sizes. And particle size is actually the key parameter which defines different soils for us. So if I were to show you a couple of different samples of some of the soils we could be getting, we could be getting a soil which is, say, have lots of big particles and lots of small particles, okay? So this soil compared to this soil would be defined completely differently because of the distribution of the different particle sizes. Okay, So we need to come up with a way of defining <coughs> different particle sizes. That's the second thing we're going to be doing. We're going to be looking at the particle size definitions. So this is a pretty um, accepted spectrum. I mean, particle size distribution is a pretty random and arbitrary selection, but this, this system is used quite a lot. So there's four types of, there's four types of particle sizes. Okay. The first one is a gravel. Okay, a gravel has particle sizes from 60 millimeters to 2 millimeters in diameter. These are all in diameters. The second we have is a sand. A sand has particle sizes from 2 millimeters to 0 0.06 millimeters. We then have <coughs> a silt which has particle sizes 0.06 millimeters to 0.00.